Hello friends. Since everybody wanted uh, Nina Mark quadrant and two benchmarking on the Carbon Smart Tab Velox 8 tablet, here I am back again with the 8 inch 1.5 gigahertz 1 GB RAM dual core processor. Let us start. This is the first time I am running all the three benchmarks. I haven't run any of them on this tablet, just download it. So let's start with quadrant standard. And let's click OK. Run full benchmark. And here you go. Since it has 1.5 gigahertz dual core Cortex A9 processor and 1 GB RAM, I expect the scores to be very high. Let's see. As you can see, the display is quite brilliant. 50 FPS, that's great. It's not even dropping below 50. It's a really great tablet. Here too, it's standard 50, wow. What the? I don't know what happened. <laughs> Let's run it again. In the previous uh, test, it was fifty. Scores haven't changed. The display is quite vivid, quite dark. The colors are quite in depth, I would say. The blacks are pronounced. The viewing angles are a bit tad unsatisfactory. And since it's not an IPS display, it's understood it's TFT. Okay, we'll click it. Yes. And the final score is 4331, just below HTC One X. It's quite above Asus Transformer Prime, Motorola Atrix, Samsung Galaxy Tab is nowhere in the league. So it's one of the best tablets in terms of raw performance out there. Let's go back. Now we'll run the Nina Mark. We'll click run. You can see the FPS here too is hitting 50. And on an average, it's about 40, 42. Yes, the average is 41.3 FPS. Now we'll run on 2.2. -two. As you can see, this is the first time running that. And start test. The upper left hand corner will reveal that I have downloaded all the three apps right now.
everything is it is run in the landscape mode in the open gl is 1.1 the fps hovers are about 24 and it seems to have got stuck surprising Whoa! Unfortunately, the N22 benchmark has stopped. I'll test that at a later time. I'll be back with the proper version of this N22. I've downloaded it from Google Play, but I don't know what's the problem. See you guys in the next video for, especially for the N22 benchmark.